<laughs> it's the Daily Special with Kimberly Bray Miller! Welcome to the Daily Special. Today is Thursday, January 24th. I broke my toe yesterday. Aww. I did. Yesterday I was um, opening up the fridge to get something and a bottle of fish sauce fell on my foot and it broke my toe. And I've never used fish sauce. It's not mine. So um, my, my aunt, though, is a chef, and she used it. And she broke a bottle and said her entire house smelled like fermenting fish. So when it fell and didn't break itself, I thought, well, at least it's my toe that's broken and not this bottle of fish sauce. That's how screwed up I am mentally. OK, well, screwed up as well is our facts from yesterday. Ruby wrote in and corrected us, told us that the New York law that they're trying to pass is only for restaurants in New York that have 13 or more outlets. So basically that only is chain restaurants. Um, luckily most chain restaurants actually do have their nutritional value available on their websites. So, well that clears that up. Hmm. Let's go to today's specials. <laughs> Well, Puff Daddy, P. Diddy, blah da da boo, he is changing his name again because he feels like he should change his name every time he evolves. So now he is Sean John. Um, so what evolutionary stage was he in when he decided Puff Daddy was an appropriate name? Great. All right. Sylvester Stallone has gained 40 pounds since the last Rambo movie. Surprise, surprise. I have too. And when asked to comment, he said, Can we start over? On the F word, Rachel talks about a Psychology Today article that came out stating that women consider fat talk a bonding experience and that young girls consider dieting a competitive sport. I know that I have a gold medal. <laughs> Interviewing is a hard skill. It is, one which I have no training in. So I'm going to call someone and see if I can get some tips. Hello? Hello? Is this Sarah? Yes, this is Sarah. Is this Kim? This is Kim. Everyone, this is Sarah Benincasa, who is the host of Tub Talk. Yeah. Now, for those of you that don't know, Tub Talk is a hilarious, delightfully entertaining interview show where Sarah interviews comedians from her tub. I do, yes. It's very classy. So a classy lady. Ooh. Now, is it actually your tub? Um, Sarah, that's my tub, but I'm a little bit of a tub whore. Like, I will take the tubs that are available. So sometimes it's my boyfriend's tub or other people's tubs. You're a tub hopper. <laughs> So, I mean, I've watched your show, and, you know, how do you choose what you're going to wear, and do you feel self-conscious while you're getting pretty unclothed? Um, well, usually I just choose sort of what's laying on the floor. It, it just depends, but I'm not too self-conscious about it, just because I figure I'm going to be on a tiny, tiny internet video box. Sarah, thank you so much for speaking with us today. Your show is great. You look awesome. Have a great day. Oh, of course. Thank you. Bye. Sarah Ben and Goss, everyone. I think the next show should be from my bathroom. Okay, well, tomorrow we are hitting the streets to see what real people think about cloned food. We'll see you then.